So Dr. Ross Anderson here again to talk about wand care and maintenance. Uh, what care and maintenance does a wand need? I mean, really? Well, it is an energetic instrument. Uh, it contains energy patterns and frequencies that are imparted to the person when you're wanding somebody. And those energy patterns can be damaged. Let's take some very extreme examples. Let's say we want to put this in a microwave oven and turn the oven on. Now, I do not recommend doing that at home or at all because you can ruin your microwave oven and you will definitely ruin your wand. Um, let's say we wanted to put this wand in a blast furnace. We're talking 6,000 degrees and get it incredibly hot and alter the structure of the crystals inside the wand, we would probably damage the functional functionality of the wand. Um, so those are extreme cases. If we drop the wand on the highway and it gets run over by you know, 50 cars and some tanker trucks, it's likely to get damaged. Those are all extreme cases. But let's take some less extreme things that might actually damage the ability of the wand to transmit its healing energy to the person. We've actually heard recommendations from certain companies that you put your wand in the fridge in order to improve the vitality of the food in your fridge. Now, I actually find this to be a, a ridiculous and uh, preposterous instruction for people because I measure electromagnetic fields. Uh, I have some very sophisticated equipment that measures electromagnetic fields and refrigerators tend to have a very large, powerful uh, and somewhat uh, damaging electromagnetic field. Certain electromagnetic fields can actually inhibit the ability of these wands, all of the different kinds of wands, to work properly. Um, this is not nearly as severe as putting your wand in a microwave oven, but if you are going to expose your wand to strong electromagnetic fields over a long period of time, you can compromise its ability to function. Things like um, the old televisions before we had the flat screens, the video display terminals, uh, old computer screens before we had the flat screens produced massive amounts of electromagnetic uh, disturbance and people that sat at these at these computer terminals, uh, by the end of the day, they were not feeling very well and they tended to get certain health problems uh, on a regular basis because of the energy. And that same energy can have a detrimental effect on the ability of the wand to function. Um, some of the other things that might affect your wand would be actually putting the wand on top of a, of a computer while it's running uh, and any other source of very strong electromagnetic or radio frequency transmissions could conceivably affect the ability of the wand to work.